An ancient tradition exists which allows couples to raise a daughter as a boy. But being a girl boy isn't easy. Kausar looks like a boy, dresses like a boy and is treated like a boy by most who know her. However, she attends a girl's school where her short hair sometimes lands her in trouble. But she says she likes being a girl boy because it gives her an advantage in a society where women often get a raw deal. <laughs> At school, my name is Halida, and my friends call me Kausar. My teammates call me Jack, and the boys in our neighborhood call me Fridun or Kanishka. When I go out, everyone thinks that I'm a boy. People never even imagine that I could be a girl because both my clothes and my hair are just like a boy's. I don't remember the past, but I was four years old when I started wearing boys' clothes. I think that people who don't have sons want to console themselves, and because of this they make their daughters into girl boys. They don't have a son, so their daughter becomes their son. When we were in Pakistan, my uncle really encouraged her to wear boys' clothes, and it's also her personality. She likes to be a boy. At that time, my uncle wasn't married. It's a tradition and custom. When someone doesn't have a son, they make their daughter into a girl boy. But I have sons, and she wants to wear boys' clothes. I'm a girl boy. I wear boys' clothes because I like it, and also because there are more educational opportunities for boys than girls. They jump and then in the air they move around and this is called gymnastics. For example, they put the hoops. They put the hoops around their waist and they swing their hoops and that's it. There is a big hoop and they take it. <laughs> Sometimes her veil slips off her head. She has been threatened a lot at school, mainly by teachers. Sometimes they decrease her marks. Really, she has been bullied so much that she came to me and cried. And she has cried to her mother as well. She went to the head teacher, but nothing's changed. No, I'm not ashamed to wear boys' clothes. I'm proud to have the courage to be a boy. One of the benefits of being a boy is that I don't have to do any chores at home. Girls are responsible for the home and they do everything. There's no problem for boys. I don't want to get married. Because when a girl gets married, she has to give up everything. And she can't fulfill her desires. I'm a member of the national football team of Afghanistan and I play as a centre forward. There's never been a girls team before. I used to play football with the boys, but my brother didn't want me to anymore. There were problems. Some of the boys found out that I was a girl. In our society, we all know that there are badly behaved boys on the streets. Because of this, they may bother her. Also, she is getting older, and now there are facilities for girls to go to and play football in. Girls should play football. But there are some people who are against this and think that girls shouldn't do these types of physical movements. There are a few girls who are boys in Afghanistan, but I don't think there's very many. I wish I had been a boy. I could have been someone who serves myself, my country and society. That's why I wanted to be a boy. I've made my decision and I'll see what happens. I've decided to always wear boys' clothes. Even if someone finds out that I'm a girl, then I'll still wear them. I wonder if she'll feel the same in 10 years' time. After the break,